exercises from my chair challenge. And uh, the reason I'm doing the video because I, I want to make sure you're doing it in a safe way. I will show lots of different progressions from the easy one to the more difficult. So what do we need? We need just a chair or a sofa if you don't have a chair, uh, a mat or a carpet will be fine too. So day one, day one is a rollover and jackknife. Uh, the best way to do rollover is to use or uh, ask your friend to help and sit on a chair to make this chair more stable. If you don't have a friend or partner or your child uh, available, you can use a sofa so it will be more um, stronger and safer for you. I will use just a chair today, so if you don't have a partner, you need to work out a bit more. It's much more challenging for your core. Rollovers and jackknives are very challenging. Many of my clients uh, have a difficulty to do it. And a few weeks ago, I had a chance to do rollover and jackknife on a Cadillac, so it's a much more support. So I decided to try only what to do, what to use uh, instead of Cadillac, because I'm sure nobody, no every person, have a Cadillac in a house. So we can try and use a chair to have a little bit similar uh, feeling and feedback. Are you ready? Let's go. So we're going to start in uh, a supine position. Just lie on the mat, make sure the chair is secure on your mat. And we do a little bit preparation. First, what I would like to do is grab the chair, stretch your shoulders, take your shoulders towards your ears and drop them down. Keep your back nice and neutral. Gently preparation. Keep breathing and just track your shoulders. Flow with your breathing, try to keep your back neutral. Great. So now keep your arms straight and I'm stretching my legs. Gently lift your legs one by one, prepare your legs and make sure you're not arching your back, but keep your back neutral when you lift your legs up and down. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Keep your legs lengthening away from your strong center. If it's difficult with the leg straight, you can keep your legs, both legs bent, still uh, having the neutral spine. Stretch the one leg, and you can do actually all together. Just one leg, five times, and we change. So it's always an option. If you feel uh, in some movements are difficult, uh, you can always change, bend your legs, or make it a little bit more easier. Good, flow your breathing, try to keep your back neutral all the time and lengthen your legs away. Good, so we are a little bit warmer, so now we're taking both legs together and just gently bring your knees towards your chest and relax. Try to maintain the shoulder positions and I keeping my arms, trying to keep my arms straight all the time. Gently lift your hips of the floor using your strong core. Inhale to start and exhale to lift your hips up. Do you feel your lower abdomen up? Yes, it's working. So you can keep moving doing this or stretch your legs and slightly lift to stretch your back and engage your core and warm up your abs. Really good. Keep reaching up and down. Lift slightly up. And if you, this is just for you, if you feel as you can't progress anymore, just keep doing this because next I'm going to try to go up and gently lowering down. The chair is helping me. I'm really grabbing the, the legs of the chair and helping me with the support. Yeah, ready? So reach up and then control movement, trying to roll your spine one, one bone at the time. Good, inhale and exhale, lift up. Nice dynamic move. If it's still difficult for you, roll, roll your hips. 
keep your legs bent is always an option. Lift up a couple more times and rolling down. Ready for the next one? I will progress and roll down. I'm trying to take my legs all the way down, keeping my glutes connected and roll up to the jackknife. Good. Make sure you're not putting much pressure on your neck. You should go as high as your shoulders. If you feel the pressure on your neck, on your cervix spine, don't go that far, okay? So we have the jackknife. Now we're going to do LTV roll over movement. So again, you can just roll your hips up with the preparation or join me. Reach your legs up. Inhale and on your exhale, lift and lower your legs and relax your legs. This is a quite nice preparation for control balance as well in here. And now control, use your core muscles to lower your spine and hips down. How was it? Not too bad. Reach over. Good. Watch your shoulders away from your ears. Watch your neck. Space here. Good. And now pull the belly button in. Roll down. Roll down. Keep your legs lengthening, 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 lengthening away from you. Okay? We progress again. Reaching over. Rest your legs on the chair. Open your legs, flex your feet, and roll down. Oh, this is a yummy stretch for hold your back line. And roll over, hold the chair, open your legs, flex your feet, and control movement down. Good, couple more. Over, open, flex, and roll down. Next time, we we'll stay and, and rest our legs. So now you can play with your arms. You can move your arms slightly forward and move your arms back. I'm going now change my legs. So one leg is resting and the one leg is going down and trying to touch the floor. You can explore and see how you feel in this movement. A little bit tricky for this one for me, with my hip. I will try, yeah. Try to breathe, breathing. Rest one leg on top of the chair, and the other one trying to touch down if you can. If not, we're going to roll down and relax for a moment. What do you think about this one? It's a lot of for the shoulders opening as well. You can grab the sofa if the chair is moving or please find a friend. It's much, much easier when somebody's sitting on a chair. I had a friend in my video on, uh, you, uh, on uh, Instagram, so you have a look. Okay, we do a couple more and then we do some, some different. So now I'm rolling over. I will combine a couple moves together. And now go to the chuck knife. Roll and go all the way down. Support with your glutes. Make sure you're not arching your back. Control. And now roll over. Rest your legs. Jackknife. Roll down with a nice control all the way down. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Support with your back line and over. I will flex my feet and open and roll down. Good. Looks like nothing, but you certainly will feel your abdominal muscles tomorrow. <laughs>